Hey guys, welcome to Broke Nerfing. Let me get my soda out of the way. This is just my workbench here. I do all sorts of stuff on here. Uh, yeah, what am I talking about? All right, welcome to Broke Nerfing, guys. Today, I'm going to teach you how to make a dummy battery. That's a dummy cell. This is an IMR. This is a dummy cell that actually works. And all you need to do is get a dart and some foil and something to cut it with and you're good to go. All right, just get a dart, a bad dart if you could, line it up next to a normal AA battery and uh, just cut it to size. I cut mine a little bit smaller than the battery. That way um, you have room to stick the foil out of each side to make the connections. Okay, so I get my foil out and I just eyeballed it. I, I pulled out as much as I thought would be wider than a AA battery. I didn't measure it and just ripped out a long strip that was wider than a AA battery. And you just roll that bitch up. You just roll it, roll it up until you feel that it's about the thickness of the inside of a dart that can be, um, that could still make it inside of the center of a dart. And when you're done, make sure it's a little bit bigger because you could always pull off some and uh, try again until it fits in there. And um, you're going to have the end sticking out of each side of the dart, which is fine. When you roll it, you want to make sure you roll it pretty tightly. Um, and when you're all done and you stick it inside the center of that dart you cut, it should look like this. Um, I make mine a little bit longer because I can cut off the extra foil that's sticking out and actually that makes it nice and flat. It gives it a nice flat connection that's going to be um, hitting the battery connectors inside the battery tray. Um, I I've read that people want to make it the perfect size. They measure the foil but I found it that just cutting it is the best way to go that way you don't need to measure you could just do it and it's simple as that um, so just cut both sides as you see there um, and you'll be good to go and next after this we're going to go ahead and put it inside the battery tray and hopefully this doesn't catch on fire or explode or anything like that so if i'm not back in the next segment you know what happened all right let's see if i can get a good enough angle sorry guys i um just got this tripod i'm stepping up in the world man yeah all right, so um, I don't know. I'm doing this. I am. I am doing this dummy battery. I'm trying to make a dummy battery. Let's see if I explode, guys. All right. So um, let's see if I can get this in here. Boom. Connect. Can I shove this some bitch in here? Stuff it in there. It's connected, I think. See that? Let's see if I explode. Yeah, so I got my little ghetto dummy battery. I actually have two dummies in there. I have one yellow one that I got for like, I forget how much it was. 
It was before I even thought I would do a channel about how little I spend. But, um, yeah, so there's my other dummy battery that I just made. And if I knew I could do that, I wouldn't have bought one. Boom. Too easy. All you need is foil, something to cut it with, and a dart. And bam, you're good to go. Alright, that's all. Laters.